this sun is doing me no justice like it's all in my eye but it's not really bothering me though but anyway i don't know why i picked y'all up but i just now got one more day to the weekend Welcome to another weekend vlog. Actually, it's part of a weekly vlog. I just, I don't think I'm going to do what, you know, I'm, I'm actually edit it or actually show the beginning of the week because I didn't do nothing. But anyways, welcome to this weekend vlog. It is Friday. I don't know the date because I get my days mixed up. But hey, the kids, they're here. Oh, look at my, oh, look at me, Stacy. But yeah, anyways. Today is Friday. It is April 14th. Yeah. Oh, I'm telling y'all, I need to get my mind right. But anyway, it's Friday, April 14th. And this is the start of a lovely, lovely weekend vlog because me and the kiddos, we are hit the spot. I'm at a stoplight, so I'm keep looking because, you know, just got out of school. I got the kids and I finna, we finna just have some fun today. Like, I have the video that I need to go ahead and put out about the hair. I also have something else coming with uh, coming for you guys this weekend. So be on the lookout for a total of two videos this weekend. If you know from last vlog, you would know what I'm talking about. So be on the lookout for those two videos. And then on top of that, we're going to have another one posted. But we're about to drive. So what they're eating back there, I saw this spot on Instagram and this guy was talking about how good it is. So I had to go in there. As soon as you walk up in that place, it's called Milk Mustache. As soon as you walk up in there, you get hit with this aroma of just lightest sweet it is so good. It's like marshmallows with cookie dough and chocolate chip. It's like I'm not somebody who really cares too much about getting like bakery goods or whatever, but as soon as you go in, it's like, damn, I want a chocolate chip cookie. It make you feel like that. And it's not even a heavy scent. Me and the kids, we stopping. We got a six pack. And they also got them some edible cookie dough. And they get to put toppings and stuff on there. The price isn't bad. Like, it's three fifty per scoop, 50 cents per topping. And like the six pack, I forgot the price. But anyway, we're on to our next little adventure. They, it's another place I saw. A new place I saw when I was driving around. Why you do? Alright, so we're back in the car. We just went to the share tea place. Uh, it smells it smells so fruity in there. It smells really good. But what I got was the passion fruit orange grapefruit tea. So we're gonna see how it you know how it turns out. Um I don't know what this is at the bottom of it though. I think it's the seeds from like the grapefruit I'm assuming. Or it could be the seeds from the orange or the passion fruit. But anyway I know it's just some seeds from one of these fruits. But the kiddos they got what did you get? I got oh you go first. Go ahead. They got the same thing but she got the boba at the bottom and he didn't. Turn the label what it says. I think he got or what is it? Oreo he got Ice Oreo, Blended. Oreo Ice Blended. Yeah. Can you take it, Mom? Go ahead. So we're gonna see how it tastes. Oh, mama, how Alright, so let's see how this thing is. Yeah, it's hard. It back. You know, the grapefruit is overpowering it. Maybe if I stir it, let's stir it and see. Okay, yeah. It's good. It's just that grapefruit. It's overpowering big time. But yeah, um, yeah, that grapefruit. I'm gonna drink it though, cause yeah, I'm gonna drink it cause I paid for it. But it's good. How's y'all's taste? How did yours say taste? Oh, okay. Well, get back with y'all at the house. Okay, so good morning, guys. Happy Saturday. Um, it is. Oh, I need to get back in that light. It is really early in the morning. It's like almost seven o'clock. I've been up for a while. I've been up since like. About five, I've been looking at my emails and 
um, checking my social stuff and yeah. But I gotta get up and do my hair because I gotta wear my wig tonight that I told you guys about last Friday. So I'm gonna get up and go ahead and do this tutorial video while the kids are still sleeping. And after they wake up, we're gonna get us some graphics and yeah, start our day. I know I look tired. You can still hear my voice, like my sleep voice, like <clears throat> let me go get myself together and I catch up with y'all later. We are back home. We've been home for probably like a good hour. Yeah, for about like a good hour. So right now I'm going to get started on another little activity that I, me and my girls are going to do. Uh, I'm sorry guys. Hold on. Like, it's something holding on to my... Let me put y'all up here. But yeah, something stuck to my... To my legs. I gotta, it's a string that I need to cut. I'm doing this little activity where you probably saw it before on Pinterest. Like, a, I saw it about two years ago, or maybe longer than two years. This actually, you know what I'm saying, on the north side. So, I saw it a long time ago on Pinterest. It's like you get popsicle sticks. Walmart, they didn't have the color popsicle sticks like I wanted. So, I ended up getting just the regular ones. And look, they was on clearance too. But anyway. I got the popsicle sticks and some glitter gel and then some marker uh -oh. and then some markers. These was on sale too. They was like a dollar and fifty cents. And then I also I grabbed this little jar. That's gonna be the container. And like you see how I'm doing because I'm gonna label the each side of the container I'm gonna label with one of my stickers that I got. And so you guys can see how you do it. And also I gotta make a TikTok about it too. Cause like the Jing the Jenga one that I did, it went crazy. That thing is at like three million views. So I was surprised about that. They like to see more activities, like girls night type things. So that's what that pretty much. That's what pretty much that popsicle stick thing is about to do. And also I gotta study. Like I need to continue studying with my uh, A and P, and it's my A and P lecture in last Spanish. Not too bad. Cause I also do like that Duolingo app. I do that occasionally, not all the time, but occasionally I do it. And it also helps with learning Spanish as well. This water. But yeah, I'm about to wash these dishes and then after that, we're gonna go ahead and get started on my little activity. Go ahead and get started on making it. This is the little list when we be <laughs> going places. And I have also the ones that they sent me on Instagram and TikTok and everything. I have that list too. I have to go to that list a little bit later. But, oh, excuse my hair. Cause you know, tonight I put the wig on that I already cramped and operated when we come back. But yeah. So let's go ahead and get started with making this. <laughs> So we just finished our both of our little art activities. Uh, you see her video before, so I can show you guys. We're letting the glue, uh, we're letting the bookmarks kind of dry right now, and we're letting my little glue pens glitter dry. But this how it turned out pretty much. Once the glitter, once everything dries on it, then we're we'll put it all together. Well, once everything dries, I put it in the jar and put it together. And then tonight, when I come back. You guys gonna see me, you know, get ready with our little movie date we having. Yeah, I don't know where he went. Oh, he, right here. For our little movie date. Put this wig on and we gonna go. Get your hoodie so we can go or get a book. Y'all ready? Peace. 
feels so good to be home. Oh, my head is itching. I'm ready to take this wig off and go ahead and grease my scalp and put the oil. I'm about to put that wig on. Um, let's check this. It seems like it's still kind of drying. Let it go ahead and dry. And then these should be almost done. Yeah, they're almost done. They turned out cute. Then I decorate the jar some more. I'm excited about it. Uh, yeah, we finna just pretty much relax. Yeah, this is the outcome of the orange hair, <laughs> or ginger as they say it. But yeah, I just, well I don't wanna, I'm not gonna comb out the crimps yet. I'm gonna get dressed and then I'll comb it out cause I don't, you know, taking the shirt off, putting it back on, put another shirt on, it's gonna kinda like mess it up. But yeah, this is one style. So I done changed my clothes as you can see. Got on a little Fashion Nova dress with the, I think this is another Fashion Nova. My little bag and some Shein, my favorite mm. shoes. And my little girl. We gotta clean this table. Nope, don't mind me. Don't mind me. We're all ready for our movie night. Moist. Get y'all moist. Smush. Yeah. This camera, I love it. Huh? This camera is so good. Hey, what's the word? Hey, what's the word? Hey, hey. 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 Oh gosh, they already doing stuff. <laughs> already starting early this morning. Y'all stop it. But anyway, we're gonna go ahead and get ready to head out the door. I don't have that much planned today, just taking her, get her nails done, and study. Cause I am gonna study, relax. I'm gonna cook uh, some greens and pork chop. That's the plan. I wanna fix some greens and pork chops today. So I do gotta go to Walmart and get me some more milk. And I'll probably give me some more eggs because I don't know. I need to start doing my meal prep again. I noticed I've been slacking off of that. But I want to do that. And we're probably just going to have a very chilled Sunday to recover. Because yesterday we went to go see Super Mario. And my behind fell asleep in the movie theater. I was so tired. But it was I saw the beginning and I saw the end. It was big. But 3D. And mommy fell asleep at the beginning. Mm. Yeah, I tell them all that. But anyway, I did. I fell asleep. It was. I was tired. I did a lot that day. And then, yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and head Sunday out Monday. and get this Sunday started. Oh, I need to give me some more Celsius too. Yeah, I do. Oh yeah. Before I forget, like, let me show y'all how the project came out. So this is this one. And you see, whatever you pull, like this is a lounge, this is a hands-on activity, we go to the movies, we got breath fix restaurants here. Uh, I can't see what that says. Oh, dessert places, like if we want dessert. And like what we're doing is like, girl, I wanna go to like a place, you know, Taco Tuesday, or whatever, we don't know where we wanna go. So you come over here, you pull, you know, just pull a random one, like, all right, y'all wanna go here? And then if we agree, we do it, but, that's that. It's just something fun I saw on Pinterest. Like, a, oh, I'm gonna say long. When my daughter's like two years old, I saw that because that's when I was staying in the spring area. But when I saw that and I thought about it, like, that'd be kind of cool for us to decide where we want to go on a weekend or, you know, if we want to do like a quick meetup. We're like, hey, you want to go get a uh, some tea or something like that or a boba? Well, ran into a little problem. I forgot last night that my tire. It was going flat like it was on 27 and I didn't put no air on it when I left the house it was on 15 so I tried to go up here to this used tire shop place that I normally go to they're not there so it's like dang I don't even know if they're gonna be open on Sundays or if they do open up on Sundays I know they're not open up this early like my tire I, don't, I told y'all I have the most issues with the tire I've always had problems with tires last month like before I got my car inspected I got two tires both of them on my right side now it's my left rear my left uh yeah the left rear it's like oh my gosh I'm telling y'all I buy tires every single month that's why I don't buy new tires because it's like 
I'm always going to, I did that before my old car used to get new tires and they still messed up. So it's like, I just rather save my money and buy a used tire when I know next month I'm going to have to replace it anyway. I called OnStar with Chevy because I don't feel like changing no tire today. And then I got my waist trainer on. I do not feel like bending over, <laughs> changing no tire because I was just supposed to be going to the nail salon and doing a little bit of my little side hustle I've been doing. No, I'm kidding. But I just plan on going to the nail salon and that was it. But now I got to sit here and wait for the people to come because I'm telling but me and the kids anyway we ain't gonna make it a stressful event we're gonna go ahead and be watching some videos they got them little snacky snacks and yeah we're gonna chill because he said he'd be here by 10 that's like in what 15 minutes that's not too bad i just want to show you her heart <laughs> bye bye all right so the guy he's coming well he's came well not he's came the guy is here fixing the tire now so we should be back on the road in like probably about 15 10 minutes and we still have enough time to make it to the nail. Oh, we still have enough time to make it to the nail shop. Like, we still have enough time. But while we sitting and waiting, I've been seeing like this caramel water. Oh, the light. Yeah, I've been seeing this caramel water. So I decided to get some because it's supposed to be like probiotic water. And I heard some good reviews about it. So I'm going to try it out and see. Like, you can look in the top and I guess this is where it said it keeps like on the. Ooh the vitamins and stuff that you need to get so you make sure with each drink or each time you uh, sip on it you get the proper amount of vitamins that you need in each thing and it's ooh, flavored it's blueberry lemon <laughs> he's lifting the car so that's why car is talking about ooh you eat but yeah he's lifting it down so if you see me tilting that's why blueberry lemonade you see and this is the nutrition back here 20 calories and you can see all the vitamins that it has. Uh, I know it's not that good, but there it go. It's just backwards, but yeah. So I'm gonna let you guys know. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be good. I, I'm I'm pretty sure, but we're gonna try it out and see. It's cool. It's like at the top. You peel it off and you push the push. You peel it off and you push the push button, and it drop like all the seeds out. Tell you, it dropping in the water and you just deteriorate it. Like I shake mine up. So let's go ahead and taste it. Oh shit, he's finished, hold on. All right, so I already tasted it. It is really good. Like, you know how some flavor waters, some have that little aftertaste, some just taste very disgusting, and then some just, this, it is very, oh, where's it at? It's very good, it's not strong, it's a, not even like a hint of the flavor, like you taste it, and it's just like flavored water. Oh, hold on. Get it to the nail salon. Uh, I'm at the Milano Nail Spa. I normally go here all the time, because ever since um, one of my coworkers had put me onto that shop, I was like, oh, heck yeah, I love, oh, I think they're open now. I'm gonna go ahead and go in and get these nails done. But I'm doing something simple. Normally, I be going and getting every design and all that stuff. Not this time. I'm just gonna get nude. Just try something simple, something sophisticated, something not so out there. Because next month in May, I already know I'll probably get some some designs. But just gonna get my normal <coughs> pink toes that I normally get. Give me a good little massage and my nail spa. I mean, not my nail spa. My nude, and she's gonna get her nails done. I forgot what she told me. I'm gonna get my uh, fingers green and my toes pink. Anyway. But yeah, it's gonna be a very relaxing time. I'm getting me a warm towel, put on my neck, and just relax. Because this morning, it wasn't bumpy, and we got it fixed. But now, I still gotta go to the tire shop and get me a new tire. And I finna take this waist trainer off. Cause driving with it, oh, like I said, I gotta get serious about this and stick to it. But yeah. You do? Yeah, I do. Alright, so we just got our nails done. I got just a simple nude. I don't know if you can see hers. I got my and she got her toes pink and mine's the same pink as hers. But yeah, we just leaving the nail shop. Now we're about to go on the way to Walmart to see if they can plug my tire up. Because I'm already on this side of town and I don't want to drive to the tire shop that I normally go to and they're not open yet. So I'm just going to go ahead and go to Walmart now and see if they can plug it up. Because that tire is good. Like I got that tire in September. So maybe it just ran over a nail i'm pretty sure that's what it is but yeah see if walmart can patch it up for me then we'll be continuing on our date but 
I don't know why I keep doing this every time my hair gets start. My hair is so oily. Well, it's not my hair. This wig is very, very oily. I'm gonna have to like wash it off. But we just made it back home. We finna check on our little bookmarks and see how they turned hey. out. They're dry, so. Except for this part. No, it's all dry. Everything is dry. But why we can't take it out? Are we about to? Y'all see it in the video, but yeah, watch her take them out. But pretty much, you know, we're at do the first part, so it'd be easy. So you just go around the corner. Like this. And you just peel it up. I had the look my look good of tennis to me, and I had to peel it. Peel it slowly. As you can see, I am in my bonnet, means I am home, comfortable. I'm gonna go ahead and finish editing their two videos. So I'm just gonna end the vlog, this weekend vlog right here. I really wanna thank you guys so much for like supporting me and you know, sticking with me through my videos. It's taken me a while to get used to doing it again. Cause like two years ago, <laughs> I, I was doing it. I wasn't as, you know, nervous. I don't know why I get nervous to talk to a camera when it's just me. But anyway, I'm going to get back in the groove of it again and come with a consistent schedule as to when I'm posting. But yeah, I'll just, I'm tired. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and finish their video so I can post that. And then I'm going to study a little bit. And who knows, I might pick this uh, camera back up and do another vlog. But once again, I want to thank you guys for supporting me. Don't forget to know, uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, the notification bell so you know when I'm done posting another video. And thank you, thank you, thank you. We getting there. We getting there. Thank you guys.